I thought the guys did a great job, had unbelievable energy. Um, I thought multiple times at during the game, we fed off of the crowd, which was spectacular. They tell me it was a record number of students that were here, and we had a sellout. So um, there were multiple times that our guys fed off of that. We made all it took was one good play, and then they got energized and juiced by the crowd. And so um, that was awesome. I was thankful for that. Um, but, uh, but yeah, we went out and we defended at such a high level. I couldn't be any uh, happier and prouder of what we did on the defensive side of the ball. And honestly, that's what all of our uh, timeouts were about, was what we were doing defensively. Offensively, you know, honestly, we keep it pretty simple offensively. They know what to do. They know who they are. I call some plays here and there, but mainly they just go hoop on the offensive end. But defensively, we needed reminders, I think, to just to keep to just keep at it. And boy, what a job they did uh, for the whole game defensively against a team that clearly is a talented offensive group. So uh, big time win for our guys, big time win for our program, uh, for our institution, for our uh, city and for our state too, and, and the guys and their families. I think that is exactly what I want it to look like. I think, I think we did things that were reproducible. Um, that, that was the biggest thing. I think the stuff that we did was reproducible. It was within our control, a lot of it. Um, they took and made some tough shots. Uh, but someone asked me a question before about the pace of the game, and I said, if the biggest difference that you'll notice in the pace of the game, if it goes, if it's really going the way that I want it to, is that they will have to spend more time searching for a shot that they like. Um, and I th and I think that's what happened for the most part. Either that, or you'll shoot early, and it'll be a shot that, you know, we're kind of we're kind of willing to concede that you're going to shoot that one. And so I think it bore out that way, that that's what we did. But yeah, certainly when you talk about sharing the ball, moving the ball, a couple of times we didn't even get a great situation, but we moved the ball, the ball was popping. I just thought the ball was moving all over the place out there and, and that was good for us on the offensive end. So those are my two basic philosophies. Offensively, get it moving. I like guys that can do a little something around the basket. I like guys that can make threes. Everybody knows that. Um, get the ball popping. The rest will take care of itself. Make some good decisions, and then you got to play your rear end off on the defensive end, which these guys did. You know, we talked about it coming in that I don't want to sound. I want to talk with no level of arrogance at all. But our guys believe that whoever we play, that that game will be the best defense that they've gone against. And so that doesn't mean that a team's not going to score a bunch of points on us. But I think they have accepted that challenge, um, and they wanted they wanted to they wanted to prove that. So they they come into the game believing, having had 19 games now uh, of evidence, they come into the game believing that if they do what they need to do on the offensive end, and they have a a pretty decent offensive day that they should end up winning the game or having a great chance and that's no matter who they play they believe that their defensive principles are reproducible for the most part they keep it simple on the offensive end and so like me I hope to have a pretty normal offensive day and if we can do better than that today we did better than that right we shot the ball well but then we end up you know, we're up 18 points because we shot the ball well. Without shooting it well, maybe you're up only a couple or here or there. But um, it's a, they have a lot of belief. They have a lot of belief in, in themselves and what we do, and, and they're a confident group. Just to stay, you know, motivated. I mean, it's just it's one win. You know, we got another game Saturday, so it's really pretty much on to the next and not get too high on ourselves right now. I mean, as a kid, that's what you always dream of, storm courts, you know, buzzer beater. So it was just an amazing feeling.